I'm so ashamed. I am supposed to be a hero of the Genova War. But look at me. Don't take all the blame. Reeve. Huh? You're not thinking of giving up, are you? I used to be nothing but a stone in the river of time. But three years ago, it was you and the others who taught me I had to move ahead. Vincent. She won't wake up. She suffered too much trauma to her head. Unless there's some kind of a miracle, she's... She's not... Uh, Vincent! You were there! Why couldn't you save her? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to... <sighs> she was a fool. She do something so <laughs> before when I asked Shalua what she was searching for, she answered her reason to live. It was you, Shulk. You were her reason to live. So? I don't understand how someone could give her own life for that of another. Do you understand, Vincent Valentine? Mm. I can't answer for your sister. But... But? When a person has someone they care about that much, giving their life is sometimes the least they can do. And maybe that's what makes us human. Someone they care about. Although, it seems like there are a lot of people around me who don't need a reason to risk their lives for that of another. And are you... Sleep here, and you might catch a cold. <laughs> Why are you so surprised? Is my face that hideous? No, I didn't. I'm sorry. 
And how are you supposed to be my bodyguard if you're up here sleeping? Uh, the warm breeze. I was only going to rest my eyes for a minute. Hmm. Well, I have to admit, the breeze is quite comfortable. However, I think you're in my seat. Huh? <laughs> Care to join me? I'm sorry. Why are her data fragments... responding? Vincent. I agree with you. This is not the time for us to give up. But I need to know something. Those data files you recovered from Shinra Manor... Are you sure there were not any more? I'm sure. I see. What's wrong? Well... The Omega Report. The file was incomplete. To make any sense out of it, we are going to require the other half. If possible, I wanted to know more about our foe before we launched the attack on Midgar. Are you speaking of Dr. Lucrezia Crescent's findings? <laughs> yes, but how did you... A large quantity of her mnemonic data fragments has been uploaded into my neural network. It was my prime directive to use this data to locate and retrieve the proto-materia. However, not only was the data incomplete, but part of her consciousness began interfering with my own thought processes. It was believed that the missing fragments may have been the reason for this. I can attempt to upload the WRO's files on the Omega Report. By combining it with the data I possess, you may obtain a clearer picture of what you will be up against. And perhaps, I can regain control of my mind. Vincent, breathe! You better get out of here! Time to get up and go! Come on, get on board! Yeah! Forward visibility approximately 95%. Communication channels radar radio. functioning normal. Network terminals online. Wide area scan shows no Gamma link operational. Radius. Adjusting settings. Six two eight one. Begin line test in sectors two through six. One hundred twenty eight percent. We need oil on the O three nine green. G nine friction levels up to point oh two four. Operating the lower valve. Main propeller at eighty percent. Propeller speed up to zero point three percent. Monitoring signal AJ one oh nine. All blocks clear. 
Main engine output normal. Now switching over Secondary to auto engine sensors. Secondary functionality check. Green. Hey, Vincent! Long time! C Captain! Oh, sorry about that. As much as I'd like to sit down and reminisce about old times, you'll have to take a rain check. Why don't you have a look around my bird until the meeting? Deep ground soldiers. A ruthless and at the top stand its VX. A small group, Rosa the Crimson. And a mysterious, it is believed. But their defeat, however, I'm not. Mr. Val, don't you remember? I, that bird was a and you won't believe that but you don't have to. wait a minute. Oh no. <clears throat> Sir, I've been spending time deep. It used to be a medical. Military personnel would be sent there. However, over time, it evolved into a and suppose a man, however, that Chocobo there. Boko, a noble, I can't wait and... Beautiful, isn't it? I've been a crew member for, but you know, I... Sir, did you notice the ceiling? Are you amazed at all? If only I could... I took part in the calm operation. That's why this... Maybe I'm not gonna... That doctor, she done gone sacrificed everything she had to find that there little sister of hers. But I just don't want to see nothing like that happen to nobody. Thanks to Shock's half of the data, I've been able to make more sense of the report. But I still require more time to piece together the fragments. I will give you all a detailed briefing at the meeting. After the assault begins, the headquarters facilities will no longer be available. And to think, just a few days ago, I was the one who was in there. No, forget I said anything. What are you working on? I'm in the process of modifying this equipment so I can perform an SND, a synaptic net dive. Synaptic net dive? My specialty within the Sviets. While retaining consciousness, I project an image of myself into a virtual reality called a network. I can also use this ability to negotiate with data on the subconscious planes of sentient life forms. However, this often involves a great risk to my own sanity. For Shinra, 
The success of the SND project was crucial for their next step in. I'm sorry. I seem to have gotten off track. Simply put, I'm creating a personal network terminal within the airship's main control console. What? Nothing. You just remind me of your sister. WRO squads will leave the ground assault. Well, we launch our attack from the air. Right. So, Reed, you ready? Yes. Fragment link. Successful. Commencing synaptic net dive in three, two, one. as we return to the planet when our life light is faded. The planet returns to the cosmos when her time has come. <sighs> Anything that has definite shape will one day cease to exist. The same is true for this world. Before she takes her final breath, the pure life streams that flow freely beneath her crust will be brought together into one. By Omega, the ultimate life form. His purpose? To gather all life, sentient and non, and lead it into the sea of stars, where it will embark on a fabulous journey along a road untraveled. However, when Omega has lifted the life from this planet, all that will remain what? will be an empty shell destined to die silently in the limitless 
void of space. Omega is the same type of life form as the weapons we encountered three years ago. The planet gave birth to these creatures to protect itself, just as the planet will ultimately give birth to the final weapon, Omega, when the end of the world is imminent. In essence, Omega is an elaborate safety mechanism designed solely to maintain and protect the flow of life. Normally, Omega poses no threat to us. It only manifests when the planet has detected something that may cause her danger. However, Deep Ground is attempting to awaken the beast early. Thus, the kidnapping. By slaughtering thousands of innocent souls, they are creating a pure life stream in order to trick the planet into thinking the end is near. Yeah! Why, are those conniving? I don't know what this vice character is trying, but he's crazy if he thinks we're gonna let him get away with it! Right. Omega is being revived deep beneath Midgar in Mako Reactor Zero. To increase the output of Reactor Zero, all the other reactors have been tied into its mainframe. Our objective is to destroy one through eight and slow the reanimation process. Mission details for each squad will be relayed separately. All right, we've still got some time before the big show. You got anything needs tending to do it? Don't worry about the reactors. We'll take care of those. You work on those four wacko. I don't like letting you have all the fun, but... You know, I can't leave my baby here alone. Cloud and the others will be shutting down the power. And there's no way we're letting Yuffie go down there by herself. Sorry, buddy. Looks like from here on out, it's Vince versus the Sphiots. We're counting on you, old pal. as well. Thanks to my dad and the Wu Sheng, things didn't turn out as bad as they could have, but... But I'm worried about my old man. He's not as young as he used to be. He's gonna have a heart attack one of these days, if not give me one. Ha <laughs> ha! 
While this airship is named after our team of loyal... To tell you the truth, the ship is not most of the machinery in the engine. Oh, no, I can almost... Almost. It's not much longer. The last time, the only reason... Not this time. I finally re... I'm not sure. I've only met with a representative. However, the WRO is crucial for this planet's survival. I'm not concerned with the reasons this person has for helping us. As long as he continues writing checks. Though... I have a feeling it is probably someone who believes he is in debt to the planet. Vincent Valentine. What? This feeling. Is this what you meant? By doing something for someone you care about? <laughs> it seems so. Dr. Crescent's data has begun defragmenting within my mind. I can see many different images images she experienced with you interference recovery so so tired
happening. A dream. A simultaneous attack from land and air. Hmm. I think they may be serious this time. They had better be. I've been so bored lately. His awakening is near. Let tonight be the final chapter. Valentine. What's this? Your phone. I retrieved it in Calm. I've modified it slightly. Just dial pound V-I-N to contact my personal terminal directly. From this workstation, I can perform a synaptic net dive into almost any network system in Midgar. I may also be able to help guide you into deep ground. It's not what you think. By monitoring your movement, Dr. Crescent's data fragments are restored within me. I'm simply providing this service for my own benefit. I didn't say anything. I, uh, anyway... My resources here are limited. Do not expect too much. Mm. I'm counting on you, Shulk. I... it's just... I've never actually been... counted on by anyone before. Uh, uh... never mind. Well then, can I count on you to keep an eye on the airship while we're away as well? Huh? I have already witnessed your strength and skill once. This is war, and we have to be ready for anything. Your assistance would be of great help. My... assistance? Exactly. Commissioner! Ah, excuse me. Vincent, I will see you again before deployment. And Shulk, remember, I'm counting on you. Oh. Fighting for. No, I have no one. No one to fight for. No one at all.
Go! Squad away. Secondary squad, prepare for drop. with Bay 9 lost. Damage to the Shara minimal. Damn! They're gonna pay for that. What do you think you're doing? You have landed several clicks off your target destination. However, considering the location of the enemy, this could work to your advantage. Head for the central complex and locate a means of reaching the top level. You will only be able to enter deep ground from the upper platform. I'll contact you again. Shelk out. Thank <laughs> you. 